because he was such a kind, smart man. The last time he told me, God sent me back on a white horse and I woke up as Brennan. I want y'all to That's check it. this video out, man. This is a very, very interesting video, man. Now, this woman's son is actually going to give her uh, a re-encounter of his 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 uh, reincarnation, okay? Um, he's even going to tell her that she may be an old soul. Yeah. All right. And so with that being said, man, let's go ahead and check this out, man. When Brennan was six, he was able to tell me that God sent him down to me because God knew that I really wanted children. And because he was such a kind, smart man, the last time he told me, God sent me back on a white horse and I woke up as Brennan. That's the kind of thing that as a parent you get chills about, but where else is this coming from? I was trying to process like how, what, what he meant. This is when you realize you're having a conversation that you're not quite equipped as a parent to have. The emotional intelligence that was in his voice when he said that to me, it was so sincere and it struck me because that's not something a six-year-old would say. Brennan started to ask me questions. Dude, I remember being a grown person before and I didn't. And so Brennan started saying to me that there were old people and there were new people. I wondered, could- Facts. And so what I, what he was saying was, is there, there's old souls and there's new souls that consistently coming in. And you no, know, that's something I really believe in. But you have to understand for a long while, there has not been any new souls that's been coming into this realm. This actually be. We were in the car driving to the store and in the back seat, he made a comment like, it's gonna be dark here soon. He sounded like a farmer. I just remember thinking what child says, I was gonna be dark here soon. And in that moment, I asked him, not prepared for the answer, Brennan, have you been a grown up before? Do you remember being a, a grown up before? And very matter of factly, Brennan replied without missing a beat. Well, yeah, before I fell off the roof and died. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised that I didn't lose control of the car at the time. There are moments in your life that you will forever remember in detail. Things slow down and you can just remember exactly where you were and exactly what your response was and everything around you is just stuck. That was that moment for me. You know, it, it almost knocked the wind out of me emotionally and mentally. Because you're thinking, okay, my son just told me that he has memories of falling off the roof and dying. So as I'm putting him in the shopping cart, I'm still trying to be very cavalier, you know, just very kind of cool. Oh, okay. So you fell off the roof and died. Oh, okay. Well, you know, what were you doing? And he replied, well, I was working on the roof and some of my grown-up friends were helping me. I was working on the roof and they were working on the walls. He was so matter of fact, it was almost like, well, duh, didn't you know? And that just knocked the wind out of me. In that moment, I thought, could he really be talking about a past life? Hey, y'all, I'm telling y'all, man, this is very real, man. The fact is that, you know, everything that they've told us in terms of, you know, how many times we actually live has been a lot, and it's been proven. It's been proven, man. We just did a live video the other night on uh, past life regression, which is something that you could do if you want to know who it is that you were in your past life, you know? So, you know, I feel like, you know, we have to open our eyes to, you know, a new way of thinking. Or, you know, even open our minds to a new way of thinking, you know, because, you know, everything that we've been told or have been taught has been taught to us backwards, man. All right. And so with that being said, let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below. And um, don't forget to go over there on YouTube. Follow me on YouTube, man. And also don't forget to follow me on Instagram at I am awakened uh, underscore chosen one. And with that being said, I just want to leave you as I came. I want you guys to always, always be aware because to be aware is to be alive. And as always, peace, family, peace, many positive energy, always creates elevation. I'll show you.